Late this afternoon, a lawsuit was filed against Navy Pier, alleging that the tourist destination is responsible for severe injuries suffered by an eight-year-old boy. Elizabeth Matthews spoke with the boy's parents and attorneys. She joins us now live with the story. Elizabeth. Yeah, guys, this Michigan family, they come to Chicago every year, every summer. Often they come to Navy Pier. This year, the boys were so excited, including eight-year-old George, to be able to climb the rock climbing wall. We're about to show you a snippet of video. Very hard to watch. This is from uh, the mom's perspective. George's mom was watching her son climb up a wall. This video shows what happened and now why they're suing Navy Pier. Go, George. He is George, only eight years old, fell 24 feet and smacked the concrete pavement. Instantly, his parents, who were watching, thought their child was dead. George broke his leg in two places, broke his pelvis and chin, and started school this year in a wheelchair. The Brewers are now suing for damages and want Navy Pier to take accountability and make sure they're taking all the appropriate safety measures. The Brewers say George was wearing a harness but was not attached to the wall when he climbed up. And underneath him, there was no net or padding if he fell. Gideon was on the ground holding him, and George was screaming. He kept saying, is this a dream? He said, am I going to die? Um, he was really confused. He wasn't be able to answer questions like, you know, what's your name? We did, you know, he did hit his head. The Brewers, that family from Michigan, they tell me that they don't want this to happen to anyone else. As for George, he did start school a couple of months ago uh, in a wheelchair. He's now out of the wheelchair and just a couple of weeks ago was cleared to run and to jump. So he is recovering. Uh, we did reach out to Navy Pier for comment and have not yet heard back. Reporting live, Elizabeth Matthews, Fox 32, Chicago.